Okay, Aquarius, I feel another one for you, so we're just going to go with it. Let me get you one of these. So, there is no blame. There is no blame. And then we turn it over. I release the need to blame anyone, including myself. We are all doing the best we can with the understanding, knowledge, and awareness we have. Accept yourself. While there's a time and place for self-improvement, today's focus is on everything that's already great about you. Let go of who you think you should be and fall madly in love with who you are in this moment. When you accept yourself exactly as you are, you shift from living for tomorrow to appreciating today. Accept yourself, sweetheart. So if you haven't watched the last Aquarius readings I did, you need to watch them. You do, because you do need to accept yourself. Even if you feel like you're not where you need to be. Yeah. And happy birthday, if any of my fellow Aquarians, happy birthday. Yeah. So, we've got this one. When I'm patient, I let the universe do for me what I cannot do for myself. This is a beautiful reading. Would you look how tall and strong that tree stands? It's probably got some sturdy roots in the ground, too. They probably run deep. The best thing about every financial meltdown global or otherwise, is learning that whatever was lost can be recreated, exceeded, and made better than it was before. Hold on loosely, the universe. Then we have Guardian of Abundance. This is a time of great success for you. All your plans are blessed and will move forward perfectly. Unexpected job opportunities arise in the near future. Make sure to accept them. This card indicates that someone with an amazing career is involved in the situation. This is a powerful person with great integrity who enjoys hard work. This person could be you. And then we have 18 Air Elemental. I embrace the element of air and am open to all knowledge and wisdom. Now let's get you our Angel Tarot card. Oh, well, they threw out a little reading right here, didn't they? Okay, we got Nine of Fire. Don't give up. Protect that which you've created. Have courage and believe in yourself. Ten of Fire. Too much work. Accept help from others. 
Life is out of balance. Stress-related health concerns. So calm yourself and don't worry. Then you've got number seven, the chariot, Archangel Metatron. An important achievement, self-discipline and willpower, public recognition. So something's going to be seen. Something is going to be seen and it's going to make a difference. So that's awesome. Okay, I actually want to use these as well. Ah. Okay, you have got six of Michael. It's the light at the end of the tunnel. Breathe a sigh of relief and make new plans. Relocation or travel. So you may be going somewhere in the future. Queen of Raphael, kind, understanding, giving, psychic. Follow your heart, a love of home and family, trustworthy psychic information. Wow, that's a good one to get. Okay, I want one more. May have, or there may be two. Yeah, there's two. Okay, we have got number 13, which is peace. Archangel Azrael, or Azrael. Uh, release the past. There is a more enriching future coming. Let go and let God. So, allow things to unfold. Do what you need to do. Allow them to unfold. And do what you're held. King of Gabriel. Generous, inspirational, dramatic, and driven. Keep your eyes on the big picture. Leave the details to others. Experience that experience that leads to success genuine concern for others so that's what i've got for you this is an awesome reading it really is till next time Bye.